Back to Five Forty on a Monday morning today, June twelfth. As we head into the uh, this upcoming week, you know we're going to have a little bit of mugginess, more of a summer feel this week as well. But we're also going to have quite a few shower and a uh, shower and even a couple of thunderstorm chances too. Uh, the first round of rain is going to come in tonight. Now, having said that, we've had a little spot shower overnight, but we're not expecting much during the daylight hours of today. We do have a mostly cloudy sky. Uh, we'll see a little bit of sun trying to work in today. And for the most part today, during the daylight hours, it will not be raining. Let's plan on some rain, some downpours, maybe a thunderstorm or two overnight tonight. So right now we're sitting at 59, which is actually a, one of the milder mornings that we've seen. And we're going to see readings come up close to 80 this afternoon. So quite a few clouds in the valley. But again, aside from a little round of light shot, mainly light showers across Franklin County that have now Disperse. There's not a whole lot going on here. We couple have a couple of spot showers across Berkshire County, but this will lift to the north and if anything will have a tendency to dry up and the clouds will give way to a little bit of developing sunshine. But notice how we have a little green showing up so we can't rule out an additional spot shower through the morning. Later on this afternoon into the evening, our shower chances will start to go up, but I think the bulk of the activity is going to occur overnight tonight. Uh, and uh, probably during the wee hours of the morning. That's where we could have a period for a couple of hours of maybe some briefly heavy rain and some embedded thunder in there as well with the passage of a warm front. So this is a little later on though, five or six o'clock. This might be overdone just a bit, but we can't allow a shower to at this point with temps in the 70s to maybe near 80 degrees this afternoon. Now, as we go into tonight, this is around 9 o'clock, notice how we have some heavier downpours, some yellows and reds showing up, indicating that rainfall. That will move through as we head into the overnight tonight. Uh, there might be an embedded thunderstorm in there as well, although we're not expecting severe weather. And then just some leftover spot showers early tomorrow, then likely decreasing clouds with a little bit more in the way of sunshine in the afternoon. So as the kids head off to school this morning, cloudy, there could be a spot shower. It's coolish with that muggy feel, but again, it's milder than previous mornings. Yesterday, we're in the 40s now. We're starting out near 60 and then in the middle and upper 70s as they're heading home, the bulk of the afternoon will be rain free and a little bit of sunshine will be working in. Temperature in Springfield now 59, Worcester's at 59, Keene same deal. You can see we have dew points between about 55 and 60, so not overly humid. They can feel just a little bit of that mugginess in the air and there's that little area of showers that tried to develop here and now it's kind of just lifting off to the north, but quite a few clouds behind it and this will lead to a mostly cloudy day. This is the area of uh, rainfall that's going to slide through more so tonight as we have this upper level low kind of spinning off to the west and then a warm front will lift through with that as well. So a shower later this afternoon and evening and then the bulk of this activity will push through tonight. It'll actually bring severe weather from about New York City and point south and we can't rule out a thunderstorm or two, a gusty thunderstorm overnight tonight. This will lift to the north and then tomorrow we'll begin with clouds, decreasing clouds in the afternoon, just a touch less muggy as the day goes on. Highs tomorrow will likely top off in the 70s. Another upper level disturbance that could bring some showers and downpours late Wednesday, maybe a thunderstorm or two into Wednesday night. So there's another round of some rainfall. And then Friday right now looks a bit unsettled with some showers and maybe a couple of thunderstorms as well. So rather unsettled, no complete washouts or anything like that, but certainly keep the umbrella on standby this week. You're certainly going to need it from time to time. Another check of the forecast in a few minutes. Amanda and David back over to you.